I drive a 6.5 liter turbo diesel Sierra. It's a 1996. It took me about 30 or 40 minutes. It's pretty simple when you have the tools on hand. The turbo is really easy to access. I just took the compressor housing off in the air intake and it was right there to work. I didn't run into any problems taking the wheel out. That was very simple. And it's actually pretty clean for being uh, almost as old as I am. But putting the wheel in, I ran into an issue where the wheel didn't go on the shaft. And I first thought it didn't fit, but Bob Riley showed me a trick. You take a heat gun to the wheel for about 30 seconds and hold it with a welding glove or whatever you have available, it'll slide right on there. It's a perfect fit. Just use a simple wrench to tighten it up because it's reverse threaded, it'll self tighten once the turbo spool. I noticed that there was a lot more power on the low end, we're getting quicker spool from the billet aluminum wheel, and 20 to 40 mile per hour was significantly faster, almost double. It's fun to drive.